Hey yo, this is Thomas. And yo, this is Mitch. We're gonna rap about radicals, that's what we're gonna do. Last week in school, we learned about radicals. Now we're gonna rap and tell you what we learned. It was Tuesday, and Miss Wagner said, yo, into this. But hey, you the teach, we don't know about this. First you pick a number and go through the steps. It's a lot of riding, so go strain your biceps. Then she said, you take your time, and then you factor down the prime. You gotta circle each pair. Hey, look, they make a perfect square. Oh my god. Then you gotta break the pair, but you ain't done. Then you take one and put it in the sun. Repeat those steps till you think you're done. Take what's left and keep it out of the sun. Don't let the inside step out of the door. Cause then you gotta factor much, much more. Hey Thomas, help me factor out 27m squared. Alright, it's cool. I'm sure it's not 5 squared. You can multiply 3 times 9, but you're not done. Cause 9 ain't prime. Now you gotta find the square root of 9. It's not that hard, you can do it in your mind. Soak your pairs in the one left over. You gotta put that one under the cover. Now to the m squared, it's got to go. The square root of that is m, you know. So you throw it out there in the sun. And let it be out there with the fun. The finishing product done by you and me is 3m times the square root of 3. Now all you gotta do is box your answer and cruise through the rest like a gangster. We got an awesome teacher. Who? Miss Wagner. She is so cool with so much swagger. My other class beast, but you don't know one. But I'd like to thank our teacher for this poem. Take, Take your, your time. time. In, In fact, it's a prime. prime. Check each pair. It's, it's a perfect square. square. Two becomes one outside in the sun. Leave the rest inside the house of radical word.